Hello again, today is September 13th, 2014. I want to show you some of the finds that I found at the thrift store. I found this uh, on Thursday, which was Dollar Thursday. And this week's tag was uh, pink. Anything with a pink color tag was $1. So, um, let me show you what I got. I found this Polaroid camera. This was $2.99. This is a Polaroid 640. This was the Polaroid 600 LAN camera. It feels really heavy. <clears throat> so I checked it. And it had a packet of film in there. But the batteries are dead. The batteries are in the film. So they're dead. They've probably been sitting there for a while. And it has a sticker on here. <coughs> Excuse me. That shows that it's been... Uh, Let's see. Been reconditioned to to factory new conditions. So it's got the strap on it. It was two dollars and ninety nine cents. I always pick up Polaroid cameras. I got about twelve of them now, and they sell pretty good. People still want to buy them uh, because they started remaking the film again. Two thousand eight. You could buy it online. So actually I want to buy uh, some film so I can start taking pictures with the Polaroid cameras. I never owned an, a Polaroid camera when I was younger. So uh, I want to get some film to take some pictures. Just because the way it looks, it looks different than these digital pictures that everybody takes nowadays. And then I found this. This was interesting. And this was a like I said, pink tags were a dollar, so this one was a dollar. This wasn't I didn't pay three ninety nine, and it feels really, really nice. And then all the buttons, they had another one exactly like it right next to it, also had a pink tag. I was gonna get both of them, but the other one was missing. Uh, the one of the red buttons was missing. It was broken off. So uh, one thing you have to do is when you go to. Uh, the thrift stores, you got to inspect the item really good before you buy it. Cause sometimes you get excited and you think, oh, okay, well, I'm going to buy this. And you don't even do an inspection until you get home. And if something's broken or missing, well, it's going to be hard to, uh, to sell it. So I looked this up when I was in the store with the smartphone. And I saw these were going for around $10 on eBay. I never saw one like this before. This is a flight control system Mark I, made in the USA. So that's why I got it, because it said made in the USA. It feels light, like it's made out of like cheap plastic, but it's got the old cord that goes right onto the computer. And it's got all the buttons are there. So I thought that was pretty interesting, like for a flight simulator. And then I got this Nerf gun. Nerf guns do pretty good for me. And the reason I got this one, this one was three dollars and ninety nine cents it's a Raider 6S no Raider CS 35 and the reason I, and I know it's missing the back piece that goes right here that makes it longer but that's not a big deal the reason I bought it was for the the drum uh, that holds all the bullets these are expensive these sell all the time on eBay for like ten to fifteen dollars just for these just for the drum magazine and uh, so that's why I bought this. You know, my son likes Nerf guns. He's got a whole bunch. So he could play with this one. And uh, when he's tired of it or doesn't want it, I'll sell it. And if he wants to keep it, he can just keep it. But um, we don't have one of these yet. We don't have one of these drum magazines because they're expensive. So now we've got one of these. And I think you can put these onto the other Nerf guns and use them with other Nerf guns. I'm going to have to find out. I think it holds like 35 of those Nerf bullets and uh, so yeah that's pretty cool so that's what I got I spent um, I think it was like seven dollars almost eight I gotta be careful I got a budget so this is all I got and this is pretty much all they had anyways they had a big transformer a big giant one 
but I don't know anything about Transformers, so I, it was five ninety nine, and it looked like a newer one. I don't know if the newer ones aren't worth anything. It looked like it turned into like a big semi diesel truck. It was all white, so I don't know. Maybe I, I left money behind and I should have got it, but um, I didn't get it. I don't have money to spare for that, and uh, that was about all I found. Oh, and then I want to do <clears throat> at the end of this video, I want to do one magic trick. So let me show you the magic trick of the day. Go over here. Get it set up. Get the camera ready. Okay. All right. You see that? All right. We got the two rabbits, and then I've got inside of this rabbit here I've got a can of apple juice this one's empty this one doesn't have anything in it so I got empty can empty rabbit tube and apple juice so in this magic trick I'm gonna make this can of apple juice move to this tube right here so abracadabra gone and it moved over to this one and then I'll change it back magic it'll just leave this one and it comes back over to here alright thanks for watching that's the end of my video